this is Space Guy. Wobbed hurt. <sighs> and a little bit of a twist this time with our videos. It's live from Philadelphia. Even though Which, we don't live there. Yep. Don't know how that works. But what I do know is that we've already been trying to do these for a while. It has taken many times. But we still have some challenges to do and we're going to do it. Ugh. Our challenge. We do not falter, so it will get done. Yes. Our and by we, I mean Space Guy doesn't falter. Heifer and Ice Dude. Heifer's challenge is to always be running as Almer. Almer is a little bit overweight and needs to burn off a couple pounds. So I could do I'm that. I could use that. Ice Dude's challenge only have one group following you at a time. And what he means by that is you can only have one color Pikmin following you at once. I could do that. Sounds interesting, why not? Forest Naval. No mixing it up, no interracial Pikmin groupings. Yeah, they're gonna hate that. When I get my song done, you'll see why. It's just weird. It's not right. It's not kosher. Yeah. They have this extreme animosity towards one another. Oh, I think we've already discussed that yeah. the reds and yellows kind of get along, but there's some weird tensions between reds and blues, and the yellows and blues I don't understand why. The, the primary colors, who cares? Yeah. Speaking of blues, <gasps> what is Hi, this? Blue. Hi, Blue! <laughs> blue is your bird, and it sounds like blue, so I'm getting... Yeah. Hi, Blue! <laughs> oh my! That Pikmin just went into the water. He's gonna die. It's already, they're already extinct. Nice. Oh, obviously well, they can survive in water. With a mouth? That doesn't make any sense. When that's actually, that's actually one gill. Oh. It just happened to be positioned where the mouth would be, so. So it kind of looks like a mouth. Yeah. Kind of oh, weird. Yeah. Yeah, it's a little odd, but. I could, I could suspend my disbelief just far enough to understand what they were trying to, oops, trying to go with them. Uh -oh. oh, and there's also another challenge that we're doing, courtesy of Void Burger, that you'll see later. And what's the cannoli that? things? He's weird looking. Kind of cute looking. Wobble in his booty. I wonder what his deal is. He seems to be stuck behind a wall. I guess I'll <laughs> never find out. And that thing is <laughs> flashing thing was, like crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he disappeared. Strange. Well, we will remember you. Yeah, Mr. Well, Breadbug. For what you were for. I guess he's gone. Oh well. We'll remember you for who you were and not what you did. Because you did some dog. pretty disgusting things. Sick. Yeah, sick, irre irredeemable things. I'm trying to keep a lookout for him, though. I'm trying to tempt him with. Trying to keep a lookout for him. Oh, guy. hello. <gasps> there he is. I don't know. Whoa, he is running fast. Because he sees you. Man, he wants these delicious. Now, this guy is called the bread bug. He's completely harmless on his own, but uh, if a pellet or enemy appears on the ground, he'll make a beeline straight for it. And if he brings that enemy or pellet back to his lair with the Pikmin attached to it, yeah, they're gonna die. So, you wanna outstrength them with more than one Pikmin. And then, if you bring him back to the Pikmin's onion, he will probably perish fairly quickly afterwards. And he can also be harmed by all of them. Figure that. He's like, um, mine. Now what I explained in the thing about these guys is if you only have one Pikmin and they drag it back to the house, it will kill the Pikmin. But if you drag it back, it pretty much will kill them instantly. So you need to hit them like that. And That was much better than the last <laughs> four times you did it. <laughs> it's this floaty... But it's in the water, so I can't like get spread Pikmin to get it. Well, you could have them just carry it out of the water and then get the red Pikmin. Yeah. 
but... So wait, is that challenge, is that only one at a time? Like, one group of Pikmin at a time, or is it one group the whole time? It the whole time? No, it's like, you can only have one out. So I'm saying, like, so if you have blue Pikmin out, you can only have blue Pikmin out until you put them all away. Yeah. Then you can get red Pikmin, or whatever, right? Have is I that... been running the whole time? I don't know. Whatever, if I didn't run before, I'm running now, so... So yeah, we'll... we'll, we'll, we'll remember it now. Yeah, if I didn't do it before, it's too bad. <laughs> I want to hear any complaints. What am I doing? No cheating. Yeah. <laughs> You're not running. Still. <laughs> no, it doesn't count. How about, what about throwing your Pikmin or something? See, yeah, that's the thing. Is like I need to, I need to stand still to aim. Doesn't make any sense. And these guys are too slow to keep up. And there's a part conveniently close to me. Over here. You're not running. <laughs> You're not running. It's It's weird how time's frozen, but the fire is still going on in the background. That's true. What's up with that? Do you have an answer for that, huh? Um No. <laughs> <laughs> I can't explain on the physics. unexplainable. Okay, so let's see how that gate's doing. Oh my god, they're done already. <laughs> Make it fun of me? Yeah. Make fun of the way you Shit. talk. Throw them, them in the water. <laughs> That'd be a good idea. Huh? Yeah. You have more than one type of pigment out right now. Yeah, but only one group's following me. Oh, just following you. Oh, God, these guys. Okay, so. Now, these guys are Shearwigs. They're very similar to the shear grubs in that once they get a Pikmin in the grass, they'll turn invincible. They also start flying once they're at around half HP. But if a Pikmin is thrown at them while they're flying, they'll die instantly, so it's not too much of a problem. You can also throw a Pikmin right on top of them for an instant kill. Uh. Oh yeah, never mind. Almond Croissant. The thing with these guys is much like the Shear Grubs, if they grab a Pikmin, they turn invincible, and you're Donut. Because they will eat them. So... Uh... Uh! Oh. Oh. Why is this guy following me so much? I guess it makes it easier for me to kill. Aha! One down. And 80 more to go. <laughs> I think it's like four or so. It's still pretty annoying. These guys are fucking worse. I wonder if I could just like taunt him. Like, come on, come here. You won't meet your demise. I Ow. promise. Just kidding, I'm gonna kill you. Come back here. Okay. I think there's only two more to go. Damn. Has that Ionium jet not, like not been in the ship yet? Nope. Jesus. Come on, follow me. Tasty Pikmin. Oh, there he goes. By the way, the oh. Ionium Jet, um, pointless as fuck because there's no ions in space. So. But it ionizes. No, but there's no atoms to ionize. It creates atoms. It's actually connected to its toilet. So that's for the atoms to fit. Oh. It's a spare claw. Oh, okay. Look at that, two more parts, and we could theoretically leave this area if we wanted to, if you so choose. But, I'm gonna do everything If you here. were so inclined, I do declare. Yes, you could leave this area. And I, I do declare. There we go. Only one more. That Madame Jean was there. That rhymed, I didn't mean to. Oh, and you don't even know it. <laughs> so if you haven't told me, been able to tell. But I guess I do show it. It's <laughs> a weird noise you make. He's laughing. Oh, why would he? That's my laughing? I'm super excited and laughing face. And for all you OCD 